Back when I was in middle school, I was desperately looking for anything remotely weebish. In my infinite wisdom, I managed to throw together the finest search terms and found an absolute treasure. I feel a need to talk about this because no one else talks about it. And everyone I've mentioned it to is amazed it exists. I think we all know what Animal Crossing is, and if you don't, I won't wish this time sink of a video game onto you. So leave now before it takes your soul. I just been fishing, you know, seeing some pals. All Rob does is fish, fish and see his pals. I'm the one getting the job, attending the go- Now that I know it's only us degenerates left, you're absolutely left wondering a few things. Why haven't I heard about this? What is it even about? Animal Forest Theatrical Version is a 2006 movie based on the Wild World DS game. Essentially, it follows the same events as the game. You're a human moving to a town of animals. A walrus moved into the village today. Hot. You have nowhere to live and have to talk to the man with the largest balls in town, Tom Nook. Nook provides real estate at a cost, putting you in crippling debt for the rest of your life and forcing you to be his wage slave. If you've played Animal Crossing, you're probably already looking for where to watch this movie. You'll probably love it. But if you don't like Animal Crossing, or don't know what that is because you didn't heed my previous warning... A real-time game that's happening every second of every day? It's Animal Crossing for the Nintendo GameCube! This movie is like the game. A super cozy slice of life about moving to a new, super friendly town filled with animals and starting your new life. Now I'm not going to break down the entire story, but I will say there's quite a bit more than just the Tom Nook chores. A lot of the focus is on showing us character interactions, trying to give as many possible chances for you to have a good idea on who these villagers are and how they coexist in this village. There isn't a very strong plot line in this movie, but it follows a lot of the more memorable events of Wild World. Bug catching, searching for fossils, the fireworks festival, watching K.K. Slider play his music live in front of people, villagers leaving, and Gulliver crashing his UFO. So why is this movie so elusive? I believe there are a couple of factors. Outside of Pokemon and Kirby, Nintendo's efforts on localizing animated content haven't been great, especially OVAs and shorter run content. For example, there's Pokemon shorts that some Pokemon fans aren't even aware of exist. And even the Kid Icarus shorts weren't even really talked about until the Smash reveal. I'm here for a little, uh, divine intervention. On top of that, there are no plans for an English release, probably because hearing Animal Crossing characters speak full words instead of animalese is a bit weird. However, I would be awful if I didn't mention there was a fan dub out there, and it's not bad. You can look at the description below for a link. Ah, no, no, no! Mr. Alfonso, special delivery! Thank you for leaving your order of 500 pies at... 500 pies?! Ah. Honestly, I think Animal Crossing would work amazingly as an ONA or a collection of short episodes similar to something like Egretzko or Nyanbo, almost like the Pokemon Generations shorts. That way they can spend a bit more time with each little idea they have instead of trying to interweave a plot into it. With the growth of the series after New Leaf and the popularity of characters like Isabel, I'm kind of surprised Nintendo hasn't returned to this concept. The only reason I can think of for them not wanting to make a short series is because of how much of the stories they tell just being events in the game. However, I think it's a huge opportunity they're missing. I'm sure that it could be extremely successful and that the fandom would just love it. Nice outfit. Where'd you get it? A garbage dump? Uh, yeah. The Animal Crossing movie is just a really interesting piece of Nintendo media. You're most likely to enjoy it if you love Animal Crossing, or like the Slice of Life series, or are looking for a relaxing kids movie. And like a villager you've ignored for two months, it's about time I wrap this up and head it out. Thanks so much for watching. If you want to keep up with me and my crippling debt, the best way would be to follow me on Twitter, 
And drop a sub here if you want to watch more videos of me talking about anime. Boys out, we wear all black. Rose shades and a pink hat. That a lot of life, yeah, we street rats. Chillin' where we be at. Diving where the beat's at. Xbox in my backpack. iPhone in my right hand. We GPS where we dine at. Lot of fucking in public. You hate, but we love it. Yeah, you try, but we done it. Squat shit in the squat fit. Drifting in that squat whip. 8-6, fuck all that fake shit. We do gang shit. Boba in the cup. What the fuck is up? Sippin' on the milk tea. So do you want to swap fossils with me later, or...?